Tony, how do you begin to put tonight's disappointment into words? It's difficult. You know, first of all, I'd like to apologise to the fans. Yeah, I, I didn't. It's something I never seen coming. You know, I think as a newly promoted team, when you come up, you know, you expect sometimes, you know, particularly against the old firm, to face difficult challenges. But I think we just made it so easy. I think the level of goal that we conceded in that first half was just bordering on ridiculous. And uh, it's hard to explain. You know, players that have not shown that all season showed a side that it was just so easy for Celtic to score. You know, when I, when I look back and I, I look at all of the goals in the first half, everyone preventable, I just think we need to take huge accountability for that because it looked like we never worked in anything, but believe me, we worked in every way that Celtic attack. But if you can't defend crosses in your box, you can't decide, you can't defend in the inside of wing backs, you can't win headers in the middle of the goal, you know, you get no chance of winning a football match. So I'm a bit shocked by it, but listen, we just need to bounce back. It's as simple as that. I've just said to the players in there, what one crumb of comfort for me is that, you know, I'd, I'd address the boys at half time and say, make sure you, you don't lose the second half. You know, the ones that went on, I think I quitted themselves well, you know, and even when we got down to 10 men, we scored a goal. So I have to look for some comfort in that, but listen, it's, it's important we move on for this and we make sure we're ready for a, a massive game coming up against Kilmarnock at home on Saturday.